Hello to our entire Greyhound family, especially the newest hounds to join us, the class of 2024. I hope this message finds you and your family safe and eager to begin the new school year. Well, as we all know, this school year will be unlike anything we've ever seen before. As the COVID-19 pandemic continues to disrupt every part of daily life, notably the economy and once again, education. I want to give you all some insight into how we've been preparing for the fall 2020 semester and putting new policies and procedures into place that will keep students, faculty, and staff safe while continuing our mission to provide an excellent education and a memorable college experience outside of the classroom. As many of you know, we have a strong partnership in place with St. Luke's University Health Network. In fact, they manage our campus health center and we've consulted with St. Luke's all spring and summer to create policies and protocols to make classrooms, residence halls, and other common areas across campus as safe as we possibly can. We've ordered 443 gallons of hand sanitizer, hung more than 200 hand sanitizing stations, and installed more than 100 plexiglass partitions around campus. These measures, along with the establishment of physical distancing parameters, and educational and directional signage in every corner of campus will help keep safety top of mind for every student, faculty, and staff member. Everyone coming to campus will be required to wear a mask and testing will be available through the health center if needed. So what will classrooms look like in the fall? Since March, when the pandemic shut down college campuses, we've invested more than $2 million to upgrade classroom technology to provide a world-class online teaching environment that will complement the in-person teaching happening on campus this fall. As many alumni, including myself, will tell you, one of the most rewarding parts of a Moravian College education is the interaction and connection that students have with our faculty. Our goal for fall 2020 was to preserve those opportunities for student-faculty interaction while keeping everyone as safe and healthy as possible and I think we've designed a good plan to achieve that goal. With that in mind, we will utilize different modalities for instruction this fall. In-person instruction. 33% of our classes this fall will include our students and faculty attending scheduled classes in person on campus with physical distancing protocols in place for classroom settings. Online instruction. This is where students and faculty will, for example, participate in scheduled class lectures, join breakout rooms, engage in group discussions, give virtual presentations via Zoom, and complete assignments remotely. 43% of our classes this fall are being offered in the online format. In the hybrid or blended format, our students and faculty will participate in online class lectures and meet in person as breakout groups we will deliver 24% of classes using this modality. To prepare for all these approaches, our newly formed Office of Online Education and Innovation has collaborated with the Teaching and Learning Center to offer 100 professional development workshops over the summer for our faculty, which, by the way, include more than 40 Apple teachers and one Apple Distinguished Educator one of only eight Apple Distinguished Educators in the Northeast. Our faculty have also been engaged over the summer with Moravian's first-rate instructional design team and educational technologist. In addition, we've worked closely with our partner, Extension Engine, and the experts on their instructional design team to offer one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions to Moravian faculty to address specific needs for the fall 2020 online or hybrid courses they will be teaching. Many students and parents have asked what campus life outside the classroom will look like. Well, the short answer is, it will be different. There is no doubt about that. The Office of Residence Life has shared a comprehensive plan to keep students safe in the residence halls and develop contingency plans if a student or students test positive for COVID-19 and how that will impact the other residents around them. To learn more about the plans in place for housing on campus, please visit moravian.edu forward slash RLH. While we know there will be many safety measures in place, that doesn't mean campus life for our students has to come to an end before it even gets started. 
We know campus life is such a valuable part of the college experience, and the Office of Student Life has been working around the clock to safely plan and adapt the events that Greyhounds have come to love over the years. Those out-of-classroom experiences where friendships are formed and memories for a lifetime are made. As I said earlier, this semester will be unlike any we have ever seen before. So the unknown may bring on added anxiety or stress for some students. I wanna make sure to mention the resources available to every student. Resources like the Counseling Center, the Health Center, the Student Success Team, and the Academic Support and Writing Center, which offers continual support whether the student is on campus or off. Those resources are listed on the new Fall 2020 webpage that we've launched to answer many questions about our return to campus. You will find the Fall 2020 webpage at moravian.edu forward slash fall 2020, where we have included a wide variety of information and resources. Things like frequently asked questions, updates on contingency plans, those student resources I just mentioned, and a whole lot more. Please visit that page and come back often to check for ongoing updates. Lastly, I'd like to thank everyone for your messages of encouragement and support sent to both me and the entire administrative team here at Moravian. They mean the world to all of us. More importantly, we thank you for the trust you put in Moravian College to keep your children safe while we educate them. We know the new school year will bring up a whole new wave of emotions and concerns for families, but please know that we will keep the safety and well-being of all our students as our number one priority at all times. I know I can't wait to get the school year started, so please be safe, and I hope to see many of you very soon. Hound them. <laughs>